nice version because today I was a little bit tired when I arrived from the airport in So I'm currently in the Netherlands going to Venice, Italy! Here we go! Hi guys, so we are on our way to Venice and I'm in the Amsterdam airport just going to my terminal to check in so I need to go to departure 7 in order for me to go to Venice <laughs> See you on the road Peace! Since I arrived very very early, afraid to miss my flight to Venice, I decided let me treat myself to Victoria's Secret. Hey. Oh my gosh! <laughs> I'm actually in the shop, Victoria's Secret. And whoa, you need to have money to visit this shop, eh? Even though they are having like sale, sale, sale. I'm just like, go! So basically, this is what I do just to kill time if I arrive very early. I can't just be staring on my phone. So I decided, ah, let me go. Since this airport is very, very big, let me explore different areas and also show you my air forces. <laughs> yes, so I'm still in the airport and I'm just seeing all the different areas that I haven't seen. Usually once I come to the airport, I'm a little bit tired so today i was like i have the, all the energy so let me show you guys let's experience europe together <laughs> hey. So I arrived very very early to the airport just for me to be on time for my flight to Italy. I mean who wants to miss Italy just for waking up so late. But this time I was a little bit careful to book my flight during the day and not to have those nighttime situations. <laughs> yes. So I'm just here at the airport seated next to where we need to go into our flight. So yeah, I think I will need to wait for 30 more minutes before we start boarding. So why not show you around while I'm waiting? And this time I have my bag close to me just to avoid unnecessary situations. Me also, we are about to go to inside the, <laughs> our flight, but I'm here just snapping, snapping, looking like somebody that is not going in the flight. So, yeah, let's go, let's enjoy this ride together. It's the first time visiting Italy, and I'm just so happy, excited, all over. <laughs> and I'm using KLM.
we we have arrived in Venice, Italy. So this is how it looks from the airport view. <laughs> this place looks so amazing. Just imagine I'm just recording it with my phone through the window, but the view is spectacular. Just look at this. I don't know how Italy is built, <laughs> but it's like the ocean and then there's land. Okay, I think it's an island. But yeah, let me admire it. It's my first time in Italy <laughs> to be pursuing matters and I'm viewing it like, you know, from the high, high layer. There is a uh, flight layer. <laughs> People usually say uh, ocean view, what one view. So what should I call this? I don't know. I will say probably a flight view. <laughs> Just look at all those small islands and small the sea is kind of it's not blue it's kind of green but not green it's still clear i don't know what to call it but yeah so let's just take all this in and enjoy the moment as we are finally approaching italy <laughs> Our bags to be packed or something, I don't know. Uh, so we are just here in the queue waiting for the bags so that we go and collect our bags because they have not yet been packed, I think. I believe so. So, yeah, in the meantime, while we are waiting, I can't just stand at one place and wait and wait. Let me walk around the airport and show you how it looks and you know i don't it's my first time in italy so obviously different airport look differently like there we can see a lady dress in venezuela <laughs> so yeah mm -hmm. i like the way that each and every country usually try to put the airport making it more like of their tribe so yeah we have another uh thing dress uh, with blue dresses. So since it's my first time in the new country and city, I just make sure that I have my notes written down so that in case I'm lost, <laughs> I will be able to show people the picture and the place where I'm aiming to go to. So basically today we are blessed with a beautiful weather. It's sunny. It's not that hot. It's just nice hot. It's not those type of hotness that will actually make you feel like sweaty, you know? It's just like this type of nice moderate hotness where you don't even feel it but yeah the view is spectacular 
we are on a bus right now heading to to venice so straight from the airport you go on to the bus and from the bus is where you will take the vaporito since it's the most cheapest option you can take the other ones but you know what this girl that hate don't got money so i'm gonna try the local cheapest option I have arrived in Venice and I was so so hungry that I just decided to go to the nearest restaurant that is close by my hotel. So I found this place with this beautiful view outside. Yes, that is the one where you can see the fishes and everybody riding the condella. Oh, but those things are expensive, bro. I really wanted to try it out, but one trip for 45 minutes or 30 minutes it's 100 euros i'm like girl i'm not a baller i'm gonna do it next time once i get myself some baller <laughs> So I'm literally sitting here at the, at what is this? At the restaurant and you can see all those fishes and um, <laughs> it looks so amazing. Okay, thank you. And then we have this. I'm so hungry, I need to take pictures but I'm hungry. So I just decided let me vlog and show you around because the food is also taking a while to come. So this is how it looks. I can't believe you can just catch a fish like you know. Fishes are just ruined. <laughs> Nobody's catching any fish. I guess it's protected. And then you have that. And a lot of what is this candelays coming this side? But yeah, let's wait. So they provided me something here to start off. But okay, what is this? Let me show you what my food is coming. I can't eat this. I need something for me. So I don't know what this is. It is Italia and I'm exhausted. I just arrived and I haven't ate. an expensive place because everything is 24 euros but yeah I'm hungry I don't have the energy to work but for now I think I will settle for it until I get another place that is more cheaper
ordered this poster this is how it looks and with my beautiful view this side <laughs> I'm hungry I hope it does satisfy me After lunch, I decided to go to the Rialto Bridge. So I'm at this famous bridge called Rialto Bridge. So it's a little bit overcrowded today, but since I stay nearby, the place in my hotel is just like five minutes work from here. I think I will time it the time that not a lot of people will be at the bridge because currently right now it's overcrowded and I know it's COVID time so I need to take some measures yes I need to take some measures but oh Italy is beautiful bruh it's beautiful and it has like you know this smaller type of bridges where you can just get lost and lost and lost I can't remember how many times i got lost but actually you learn a lot from uh getting lost and you also find out hidden gems through getting lost so that's what i'm talking about that this group get overcrowded so right now I decided, uh-uh, I'm gonna come back here early in the morning or maybe at sunset just to come and see. Even right now on the bridge, you can't even get a place where you can grab your hands and just watch the view. So I decided, uh-uh, this is not for me. I'll come back when it's a little bit calm. Hey guys, I am in France, Italy. Seems like you can't see me. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. And I find myself in Venice, Italy, <laughs> at the San Marco. Uh, what is this? It's like a tourist attraction place. So this is where I find myself. Why am I so dark? <laughs> I need better lighting. It's like 10 o'clock here. So the light that I'm behind is so the light that I'm relying on is just the light from the sunshine. <laughs> is it sunshine? <laughs> I think I'm satisfied, that's why. So basically... This is how the place looks. I actually just dream of being in these places, but I never thought that this could be a reality. <laughs> just look at all of that. So tomorrow we are going up there at that high thing. It's only a little bit dark so you can't see. Tomorrow I'll show you a nice version. Because today I was a little bit tired. 
when I arrived from the airport and I had a horrible headache. That's why. But I want to go and listen to these people playing music <laughs> since they since this is a public place so the music should also just be public. I would love to go and sit at the restaurant but one thing with Italy is that if you sit at the restaurant they will charge you for sitting and also they will charge you for service fee <laughs> which I find a little bit strange because I experienced that with my first uh, lunch that I actually sat at the hotel but right now it's like no 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 I will need to admire from afar so I'm not the only one admiring from afar. All those people that are standing there are admiring. So yeah, so all those restaurants that are near the San Marco Square, uh, you need to have mola. Unfortunately, this girl doesn't have money. Hopefully, I will save up. One day, I will need to be seated at that portion. I will just need to save up over car. But damn, this place is beautiful. You just don't feel like sleeping whenever you are in Italy. <laughs> <laughs> 